You know, some of the talk out there right now is regardless of what President Trump does with China. Now, this is coming from the liberal side of the financial sector. No matter what he does, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter what he does. We, he's not going to reduce the deficit. You know, things are still going to be a problem. We're still going to, as a matter of fact, most are saying the deficit is going to go up because we're going to be buying more goods than ever. Now, let me just, let me just put some clarity to this uh, ridiculous statement. What they're saying is Donald Trump and his team, they're the words, Donald Trump and his team are doing nothing for the economy. And they're not going to see anything with China except the trade deficit with China go up because we're just going to be buying, we're still going to be buying Chinese goods. Now, let me just tell you what they're really saying. They're not smart enough to think about this. So let me just tell you what they're really saying. What they're really saying is that the trade deficit is going to go up with China Because President Trump's economic team, President Trump's philosophies, President Trump's government management is so good that we now, for the first time in eight years, have real GDP growth. We have confidence about getting a job at an all-time high. We have consumer confidence at an all-time high. We have consumer spending that continues to be better and better every month. We have wages going up for the first time in 13 years. And We, because of all of that, have more money, so we're going to be buying more goods, and a lot of those goods are going to be made in China, so therefore the deficit is going to go up. So what they're saying is they're criticizing President Trump because the deficit's still going to go up, but they're saying that the reason it's going to go up is because the economy is doing so good. How do they think? They think President Obama still got the economy running up? Is that what they think?